Now what I have seen is I tried to make a video to show you how to fix the different cables of the motors and together with the controller box here. So what you are seeing now is all of the you know the electrical elements inside the controller box. And this one is a PLC, right? You you know we made of the Siemens. This PLC is made of a Siemens brand, like this. Uh, this one Siemens, right? This one. CPU. You see the CPU? And Siemens, right? And you. And uh, you see here, this this one. This line, you see, it's very big, right? Big size. This one. Uh, big size. This one is for the the main power of the electrical electrical uh, source, right? So uh, there are three, right? Is uh, because it's three phase, three line, three three lines. We are connect be here. We are connect be here. Okay. This switch is the is the is the start is the start is the end of the electric uh, source. So this one, the power source the cable will be fixed here. So one by one, right? Okay, this one. And uh, I want to show you the different motors of the line. So what's next? You have to do is. Uh, And uh, what you have to connect is uh, the the different cable from the different motor. Okay, so like this line. Uh, and this line. This cable. And this cable. Uh, there are two cables. You know we have uh, two vibrator. Uh, there's two vibration motor. This one is the vibration motor, right? This one left side, and on the right side, the right side there's uh, another vibration motor. So this two vibration motor, the cable will be connected here, right? And this cable is from the uh, the right the right motor right vibration motor, and this one, this cable this cable is coming from the left vibration table uh, motor. So we can connect together, right? So here, and uh, before delivery, and before delivery uh, delivery, we will make a mark on the line on the line like this. Like this, like this one. You know, here. You know, You know, for each mot, uh, for each motor, there will be three, three location for the connecting, for the connection. For each motor, there will be three location for connection. So that that means uh, for one one uh, one motor connection, there will be the U1, V1, and W1, right? So before delivery, we will uh, make a mark here. On each line, on each line, like this one, we will do uh, the the white, uh, you know, this white circle. We will mark number like U one and uh, V one, W one, uh, maybe here, right? So we will mark the here. Is this one is U one? This one is V one. This one W one. So you will find each each number and find out uh, here U one, V one, W one. You will connect here, right? So it's very easy, okay. And uh, this keyboard, and this keyboard, U two V two. Oh, And uh, this keyboard is coming from uh, here. It's coming from this this uh, this moto. This moto, this moto is for uh, mixing and spreading material. Mixing and spreading material. Uh huh. So this motor cable will be connected here. Will be here. So also the same same. Also the same. We will mark the here. Mark the this one like a U three and V three and U three right and V three and W three. You will you just find out the mark on the Y 
and get to, and find out the sim, sim, uh, correct location here. So you connect uh, each one, right? Each one. Okay, that will be easy. Uh, and uh, the fourth motor is the is this motor. <coughs> is this motor? Yeah, yeah. And this motor is uh, to supply the power to uh, to push the material cut, material fitting cut in forward and back. This motor. This motor is to give the power to move the material fitting cut forward and back. This motor, right? So this motor people. It's see, it's this one. So this one. We will also mark here and we find out, you know, the U5, V5, and W5, right? This one. Okay. And another motto is this motto. For offloading the hog, you know the mode here, right? And you know the head mode, right? This head mode, this head mode is lift, is hold, is hold by this hook, by this hook. So that means uh, the time you plan to let the head motor drop down, so you have to let switch on this motor, this motor, right? This motor. Uh -huh. So this motor, the cable, you will find out also the same time, right? Same number, same number. And U6, V6, and W6, right? U6, W6, and uh, v V6 here, right? Uh, and the next motor is, uh, is here. And this motor is a little difficult to find out. And this motor, as you know, that down the, it's under the pallet feeder system. This motor is under the pallet feeder system. Is uh, this motor is the function is to supply the power to push, to push, to feeding, to feeding, to feed the pallets in a uh, forward, forward and back, right? So this motor. I can't wait to Okay. And this motor, the cable. Motors cable also will be here, so you will connect the keep the wine to U7, V7, and W7. Okay, same same. It's very easy because we will mark here. We will mark the number here for the different uh, wines. And the last uh, and the last location is for what? Is for is for the for the motor for the transport blocks here. Is this motor? And this motor, this motor will be transferred the blocks after for me. Will be transferred out the blocks with the pallets and transferred to the stack machine to this motor. And this motor, and will be connected here. U8, V8, and W8. So it's very easy, right? And uh, and what you what what's next? To, uh, what next? Next to do, and uh, next, uh, and the next one you have to do is uh, this one, uh, this one, right? This one. This cable. This uh, this chart, this chart, this chart head, is coming from the sensor. Okay, the sensor is coming from here. This line, this cable. So normally here you no need to do any adjustment, ad adjustment. So before delivery we will fix everything here. So this controller box, uh, normally you don't need to do any to do anything on it about it, right? Okay. This keyboard, you see this keyboard. This keyboard is here. Is it chart? And try to remember, 
try to remember this you know this that's the uh, different uh, this one is the white one this one narrow one so narrow one will be at the down direction the white one will be up direction so use this direction and to chart it okay to chart it and use here to lock it that's all that's all and uh, you know the sensor here the sensor now what do you see I will show you the sensor function, different sensor function here. So like this, this sensor, this sensor right here is to control the, 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 the mode box uh, down location. That means uh, when the mode box touch this sensor, the mode box will not go down anymore. Okay? And this sensor, you know all of the sensor we will fix. All of the sensor we will fix onto the block machine. So you no need to change it. You no need to change it. So this sensor is here. That means uh, after the head mode is lift up, after the head mode is lift up, and uh, they will do a recycle, and we will drop down to here. After this ion uh, from the top top location and drop down to this location, after this ion touch this sensor, and the the mode box will be drop down, will be drop down, and after the mode box drop down and touch this location uh, this sensor, so the mode box will be stop, and uh, by that time by that time. By that time, the material feed system will be, uh, you know, to go go front, go front, to feeding and spreading the material inside the mode box. And uh, here, and here is this is a, is a, is to control the material feeding cut from uh, front location. This one front location, right? So this is a, and this is a is to control the material feeding cut and back location, okay? So, and this sensor, this sensor is to control the pellet feeder system back location, right? And uh, that sensor here is to control the pellet feeder system front location. So it's, it's easy, right? And uh, there's another sensor here. This sensor, this sensor, that means, uh, after this motor, right, to offload in a hook. After this motor to offload in a hook. And after this iron, go back touch this sensor. Right? So this motor will be stopped. This motor will be switched off. That's all. Okay, now I want to show you this is the block stack machine. The block stack machine. And uh, what you have to do, have to connect uh, the, with the stack machine is, uh, is this line sometimes. And only this, and only this cable you have to fix. You have to fix this. And this is a switch, right? It's the power switch. It's power switch. So you have, you have to fix this cable, three wine, together with uh, this switch. So you can see this, uh, this, one, this cable, right? Here. Yeah. Okay. Mm. This one. This one. Right? This cable is coming from the stack machine. This cable. All in this cable. All in this cable is coming from the stack making machine. Uh, stack machine. Block stack machine. Right? Will be fixed here. Uh, same as the main power. You know this one is the main power for the block machine. This cable, this cable is uh, is for the block making machine. Will be fixed together with the power switch, the power switch here. Okay, okay. So, and all of this, uh, uh, and this connection, no need to change. No need to no need to do anything about this. So before delivery, we will fix. We'll be fixed the different cable here very well. So for the customer, you don't need to do anything about this box, okay? Uh, okay. And also for the for the li like this uh, limited uh, lim limited uh, switch, you know we are fixed well, we are fixed well. And for you, you don't need to, to do anything about this, right? So like this switch, right? So after this uh, stack machine touched here, they will. A stop. We are stop. 
following down and we will transfer uh, we will go front we will go front and uh, this switch right so after this this block uh, block stacker go up touch here right so they will stop uh, uh, stop and uh, going up they will you know to go front right and uh, after this stack machine attach here attach this uh, limited uh, limited uh, switch they will not uh, they will not go front anymore they will drop down to stack the pellets one by one okay so the stack machine is easy to be to be understand you have to fix the for this uh, stack machine like yeah you know this one the controller box of the stack machine the controller box of the stack machine and what do you need to fix the, is this line is a uh, number is number 9 and 20 this one this fix uh, no no this this keyboard this keyboard you know is for connect here is connect uh, uh, yeah it's here so and this limited uh, switch right it's on the block transfer system block transfer transfer system so that means uh, when the pellets come out fr from the block machine and uh, the pellets with the blocks attach this one attach this limited uh, switch so the stack machine will start working the stack machine will start working so this line this line right this line will be fixed to number nine and number twenty and later on we will make a mark here we will mark we will make mark uh, make a mark uh, on the on the line okay so you will remember uh, you will find out the same number connected and uh, and this one is number one number two right number one number two okay this line this line will be connect here Will be connect here. This, yeah, 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 it's here. But now, before delivery, after I don't know, after delivery, this line will be fixed on on here. No, we will not re release. We will not. Uh, we will not remove this line from this part. So you don't change it. So what you need to do is just uh, connect this line, and uh, together with the stack machine. Together with the stack machine here. Okay, number one, number two, number one, number two. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm not going to. It's stuck in my machine.